New at six, a Tennessee man sentenced to life in prison for a 1992 Edge Hill murder is eligible for parole. His wife spoke with News Channel 5's Brandon Marshall about their life and how she's feeling hours before the parole hearing. More than 20 years after Cyrus Wilson was sentenced to life in prison, he'll sit before a parole board tomorrow hoping for good news. The only other person who may share his anxiety is his wife. For Casey Wilson, it's normal to reminisce about her other half through pictures. That's one thing about prison is that there aren't pictures of people. She visits her husband Cyrus at Riverbend Prison every weekend. The two met when she was 17. In 1994, the judge sentenced the then 19 year old to life in prison for first degree murder. But decades later, two alleged witnesses recanted their testimonies. There are a lot of good people behind prison walls and Cyrus is definitely one of those people. He is an exceptional person. He is smart and he's kind. He's super considerate. Wilson will sit before a Tennessee Board of Parole member tomorrow for the first time. Casey, family and supporters anxiously plan to attend. He's not really sure what to expect, but I think, you know, he's confident in who he is. He's confident in in you know, his growth, he's confident that he can be productive out here. These pictures capture the couple's love during holidays, birthdays, wedding anniversaries. You got married on April Fool's Day? I'm like, yeah, my husband said he'd always been a fool for me, so. It's their norm, but both would like to have a different picture perfect life together outside prison walls. In Nashville, Brandon Marshall, News Channel 5. Thank you, Brandon. We're told the Tennessee Board of Parole will not actually vote tomorrow on Cyrus's case. Just a hearing, a final decision granting or denying parole could happen in about two weeks.